Hello and welcome to this video where I'm happy to announce that I'm publishing a free ebook titled A Primer on the Nonlinear Schrodinger Equation, which is this wonderful equation right here that describes how light changes as it propagates through a medium where so called chi 3 nonlinearity is present. A link to this book is available in the description, and I thought I'd take a few moments to explain some of its main features that might make it especially interesting to newcomers to the field of nonlinear optics. So those who followed my channel for a while know that I publish videos where I try to explain both the mathematics but also the intuition behind different phenomena in nonlinear optics. My reason for doing both these things is that I found in my own research it was important to both be able to calculate things exactly but also to have a visualized picture of what's going on with the light because it helped me troubleshoot experimental setups and develop new ideas for things to test and play around with. So hopefully this work is going to give you the same sort of uh, tools that I've developed uh, visually to understand how nonlinear optics works. Another feature is that I'm both using the work to link to more sort of formal academic works on the subject of nonlinear optics, that is to say papers and books written by professors and people who are way more qualified than I am, but I also link to, I guess, more um, informal resources such as video lectures, especially on YouTube, but also to a set of uh, custom Python notebooks I've created that explain different topics in nonlinear fiber optics. They all contain my custom code for solving the nonlinear Schrodinger equation using the so-called split-step free method. And the idea is to give you a chance to play around with the different parameters that go into this equation in isolation, see how, for example, uh, the propagation of solitons changes if you uh, add self-steepening or how self-phase modulation changes if you use a different pulse shape. All of these things you can try interactively with these notebooks. So I highly recommend that you check them out when you download and read the ebook. And I guess maybe most importantly, the book is going to be freely available and continuously updated on GitHub. I think a lot of students have experienced the frustration of wanting to access an important or interesting research work and then having it locked behind a paywall. So I'm trying to take the opposite approach here of making it freely available, but also updating it in response to reader feedback. So if you find any mistakes or anything to be clarified or maybe have some suggestions, I'd have to take them and update the work continuously. For example, just now as I was making this presentation here, I noticed that there should have been a parenthesis around the 3 in the chi 3 right here. So it doesn't look like chi cubed, but like chi 3. So that's a small mistake I just noted right now, and I can easily fix it, update it, and make sure that everyone has access to the most polished version of the work at any given time. Finally, and this is on a totally different note, I'd like to say thank you to all the people who've been subscribing to my channel and watching my videos. I'm just about to hit 100,000 views on my whole channel and 2,300 subscribers, which is honestly way more than I ever expected to get, given that I talk about a very niche subject with a niche subject, that is to say, nonlinear fiber optics. So thank you very much for um, following my videos. I hope to publish many more in the future, and uh, I guess I'll just see you in the next one. Bye-bye.